Before you begin using your My Language Lab course, there are a few first important steps that you need to do to ensure that your course will run smoothly on your computer. First, you will need to do a browser tune-up check. This check can be found on your homepage, www.mylanguagelabs.com, and you'll need to look for a red icon called Browser Tune-up. This red icon will also appear on your Today's View under your Getting Started, and you can access it directly from your course as well. Second, you will also need to make sure your pop-up blocker is disabled, or you allow pop-ups from Pearson. And third, you will need to check your time zone setting, or set your time zone. Let's walk through all of these steps right now. The browser tune-up located on www.mylanguagelabs.com to make sure that your computer has all the appropriate settings it needs to listen to the audio, hear the video, and have the ability to utilize the resources provided to you inside your My Language Lab course. Simply click Run the Tune-Up Now and you'll be brought to the browser tune-up and check to make sure that you have everything you need installed. If you do not have something installed, it will let you know, including providing a link to download it directly to your computer. There's no additional charges and we highly recommend that you install all of the items listed in your plugins. Also, if you're going to be doing any voice recording, make sure you run the setup wizard at the bottom of the browser check. This will ensure that you can properly record inside your My Language Lab course. Please note too, you will need to have a microphone, internal or external, that works while you're making your recording. If you run into any issues, we highly advise you run this browser setup in the browser that you're using when you are completing your language lab assignments. If you have any questions or need any technical support with installing your plugins or any questions about something going on in your course, you can always click Need Help in the browser check and this will link you directly to our tech support website where you can always chat with a live agent 24-7, send an email, and at any time you can always search our knowledge base by clicking on Find Answers. And when you are inside any My Language Lab course, you're always able to click the support button in the upper right hand corner, no matter which My Language Lab you're using and which textbook. Click support and you'll have direct access to tech support. There'll be a link inside the window that opens. Click here and you'll have access to the tech support site. Also inside your course, you will always have access to a student user guide, which will include additional videos on how to navigate through the course and answer any questions you have about how to use your My Language Lab course. Another important step is you must make sure that your pop-up blocker is either disabled or allows pop-ups from Pearson. Everywhere inside your course, if you click on a link, this will open in a new window. If you click a link and nothing happens, this means that you need to check your pop-up blocker setting on the browser you're using to access your My Language Lab course. Inside every My Language Lab course on the Today's View, step two under getting started will be disable pop-up blocker. If you click on this link, it will then bring you to a document that you can view and it walks you through the quick and easy steps of turning off or allowing pop-ups from Pearson. This document will walk you through all the different browsers you may be able to use with your My Language Lab course and how to specifically turn off or allow pop-ups with that browser. The third important step you must do is also check and set your time zone setting. You can click on step three under getting started to get a document to walk you through the steps I'm about to show you. Inside your My Language Lab course, you will have a My Profile link. Click the link, My Profile, and a new window will open. You want to check to make sure your time zone setting is set to your correct time zone. Use the drop down menu and select your specific time zone. When you are done, don't forget to click Save to save your time zone settings. This will be saved and updated to your Pearson student account so you never have to do this time zone setting again. 
However, if you do need to adjust your time zone at any time, you're always able to go back and click the My Profile setting and adjust and save a new time zone. Notice you also have a direct link to the browser tune-up directly from inside your course. So make sure you use the browser tune-up on any computer you're using to access and use your My Language Lab course. This concludes the first important steps you need to do in order to use your My Language Lab course.